Hi guys, Bambi for Spurred On. We're here at Fiorentina. We've just drawn one all uh, with the Italian club. What did you make of it, mate? It was. Uh, I think it's a pretty good result in the end. Yeah, i got to agree. I mean, we got the away goal. does put us in advantage. I mean, uh, nice little goal. Just saying about the deflection. I mean, after I think that period in the game, we could have possibly nicked it. I mean, we've had a few chances. But, you know, overall, I'll take a point here. I said, if, well, I said at the beginning I would take a point here because, you know, we still got two legs. A point by which you mean a draw? Sorry, draw, draw, <laughs> by. Um, draw away goal, yeah. away goal. Sorry. So, so um, I thought I felt that uh, first half we were absolutely by far the better team. They made exactly. a couple of uh, decent chances. Second half, really, is it fair to say that they're kind of because I think they played better than us most second half, but that came as the result of the momentum of getting the equaliser. Yeah, I do agree. I mean. I was um, losing that goal. I mean, gave them the possession. We were playing a few sloppy balls. I mean, they had us on a few danger moments here. So, you know what? It was very nervy during that period of time. I think after 70 minutes, we sort of got back into it. We stopped playing a few yeah. less sloppy passes. We are starting to possibly get back. Yeah, you know, it was be a bit more solid. But uh, that period of get the um, time between when they got the goal and to 70 minutes, I think we were in danger of possibly yeah. losing it. But, you know, we're playing pretty much, uh, you know, pretty uh, mixed side. Uh, it, I was very impressed overall with how our uh, players who haven't been playing as often. Uh, Ryan Mason, I thought, played well considering he hadn't played for so long. Uh, and it just shows how the depth of our squad, doesn't it? Yeah, Ryan Mason. I mean, Michel Vorm also, I thought, played well. I mean, could try to find saves. Help. I mean, usually, he'd be uh, uh, last season, he have been a bit dodgy. But this time, he's making a few solid saves. Um, kept the uh, game during that period of time where we were under danger in danger yeah overall good team performance um i think ben Davis could have improved a bit but um you know what overall it's, it's a decent it's decent yeah yeah and then just looking ahead to palace on sunday you know will he bring in the players who didn't play tonight and, and what's your prediction for that game uh my prediction well i think that i think palace are really going to go for this one because you know what they don't really have much going for their season so i think the fa cups are the last hope so i think they'll put up a full squad uh it won't be easy i'm gonna go 2-1 this time um but yeah i think Maybe a few rest a few players who played to, today. Maybe bring on a few back. I think Loris will probably still be injured, yeah. so Vaughan will be here again. But yeah, a bit of a mix and match between the players who played today and players who um, re rested. Maybe some could be coming on as impact sub to maybe get as a last bit of goal or just hold the lead. So yeah, that's what I think. Two one, he says. Let us know what you think uh, the score will be on Sunday in the comment section below and uh, what you thought of his comments. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Follow us on Twitter at Spell on TV. Cheers, mate. Brilliant. Yeah.